What's up gamers, welcome back to the Paper Mario Thousand Year Door Danger Mario Run. It's your boy CD Rom 1019 and we're picking up where we left off at the beginning of chapter 6. Uh, next to the Glitz Pit, this is my favorite chapter of the entire game. I'm really excited to begin this. Let's get started. <coughs> Mario's room on the train. Access Express, this is deluxe. Three days to posh the heights are gonna be over like that. Oh. <laughs> Piece of paper on the floor here. <coughs> Don't go to Poshley Heights, get off the train now, or a sticky yummy doom awaits it. Freaky throw, you don't think this could be Bellum's work, do you? Whoever this cycle is, you gotta figure out they're on this train. You gotta get this nut before anything bad goes down. Oh, yeah. Take a look in here real quick. There's a dried shroom in the drawer. Could have sworn there was something other than a dried shroom in there. There is a shine sprite right there. We're gonna grab that. All right, we are in room five. Let's go talk to some of the other people here. Nothing going on in here. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I know you guys have been sticking with me for a while and hearing me cough. I apologize. I've been kind of congested the past few days and not much I can really do about it. <coughs> hey, it's Toodles. I'm just checking these rooms for items so I don't have to check them again. It's the star zip toad. Oh, nothing in there. <coughs> Alright. So we've got this sticky, yummy threat of sorts, so we're gonna check in with some of the other people on the train here. Now we're in the dining cart. <coughs> chef, S chef sashimi, or sashimi. A quintess, cheap, cheap native language. Just cooking today's dinner. There's a shop on the train. <coughs> da, 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 da. I'm on my way back home, sit so long, forgot what home looks like. Oh, okay. <coughs> hey, it's the bomb family from Glitz Pit. Star piece, yay. <coughs> Here's the conductor. We're gonna tell the conductor that we got a note. <coughs> and now everybody's in here. It appears that the uh, 
that in that time it took us to talk to everybody, the stew pot had been stolen. <coughs> Case of the pot of super of supper stew that mysteriously vanished, or that vanished suddenly and mysteriously. That'll do nicely. <coughs> My dear train pass is a full flex mystery, one that impacts you all. <laughs> what exactly kind of tish is that? Pennington! Detective Pennington. <laughs> Perpetrator took the whole pot of stew and all in this at this esteem, friends. We believe the one responsible is you, you gluttonous woman! No idea what you're talking about. Pardon me, sorry, please accept my apologies. If I'm needed to practice my accusation skills. <coughs> oh. Not bad. <coughs> Don't know who the culprit is, and I guess that's about it. You there in a bit of a hurry to get back to your room, you're highly suspicious. <coughs> Can't say it deserves such a verbal thrashing. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, so we have a clue. Traces of something in the carpeting. <coughs> Alright, let's follow the trail to the to the perpetrator. It happens to stop right here. What do you want, burp? Sorry about that. What were you just saying? It popped in the kitchen. Oh, I get it. Food gets stolen, you blame the chubby guy. Not nice. Drops the floor outside? No, I wouldn't know anything about that. People spill stuff. It's nothing in the drawer. No need to look. Let's look. Something under the magazines. We got the galley pod. <laughs> you hated all it was me. <coughs> Keen sleuthing instincts identified you as the correct person to collar the ruffian. About that note in your room, I know of it. I'm a lone detective on this train. Cannot speak here, find me in room six. <coughs> oh, and please return the pot to the chef if you could. Alright, let's go return the pot to the chef. Peace to thank us. And we'll go talk to, the te to Pennington. <coughs> <coughs> he doesn't think that the one we apprehended is the person making the threat. <coughs> if decided, then I shall take you on as my new assistant. To reiterate, my name is Pennington. I'm a detective on Poshley Heights. In some circles, is a penguin with a probably large brain. <coughs> I demand you not tell me your name. I shall deduce it. A mustache, that nose. You, sir, quite obviously are the famed Luigi. <laughs> Don't introduce yourself. I know all about the famous Luigi. About this threat, our man has declared the intent to yummify the train. Sticky taste the explosion. That family of bob -oms, they are definitely suspect. <coughs> Alright, it is now evening time on the train. This is the wrong room. Alright, so now Gold Bomb and Silver Bomb are arguing about what they should get uh, little bub here. <coughs> You detecting now that you quit being a champion? Well, so, sure, I'm a pro. 
Really? <laughs> if you bring me what I want, they'll give you something in return. Here's a hint. Starts an A. Got it. Second hint. Person's autograph. Now you get it, don't ya? And then we'll talk to the conductor here. <laughs> One thing I heard that was cute, the boy dreams of being a train engineer someday. Interesting dream. So, with that being said, let's go get the autograph of the engineer of the train. Sir, that's for a little bub. Yes, of course. Here you are. <coughs> all right. Never can I grab that. Felt fantastic. Now let's give it. Up. Go all the way back and give it to little bub. Detective, something for you, just like I said. Hey, gave me Shine Sprite. That's very nice of him. And now it's nighttime. What's a detective, anyway? <coughs> I actually really like being on the train at nighttime. I think the music is the music at uh, the nighttime music is the best. Alright, well now that it's nighttime, there's nothing more we can do on day one of the train, so it's time that we go back to our car and head to sleep. <coughs> At least I think. Uh rest for the night. <coughs> oh, no, it's still nighttime. I am totally wrong. There is something that we missed. We gotta go back and talk to the conductor. Glad you spoke to me and remembered something suspicious. <coughs> Found myself on blanket short when I was handing them out to the passengers. I gave the last passenger my own blanket to make up for it, but it's vexing. I have exact blanket counts. It means someone came on board without a ticket. That stowaway just might be your suspect. Not only that, but if I don't get my blanket back, it'll be too chilly to sleep tonight. Call me Blanket P.I. <coughs> So in case you're writing a novel, let me save you some time. The plot twist is that there happens to be somebody in room four. <coughs> of course, nobody's here, but if we hide in the shadows for an extended period of time, there he is. Hey, buddy. You found me. As you see, I'm a ghost. I'm cursed to haunt this place. A blanket? Well, yes, the conductor did leave one here. Didn't realize that I'm a ghost. A yummy sticky threat? No, I left no such thing. I can't even hold physical objects. You just want the blanket then? Well, I'll tell you where it is if you do something for me. Fine. All I need is your life! No, just kidding. Actually, I passed away in this cabin many years ago, but I think my luggage is still in the baggage car. Inside my bag is a diary I kept since my earliest childhood, <coughs> and my fear that someone will find in Reddit has kept me tied to this world. Can't leave this room, can you please find it? 
And don't you dare read my diary, because if you do, a horrible fate awaits you. Alright, go back to Yasi. What's going on? <coughs> a ghost, and he won't give you the blanket unless you get the baggage from the car, a tire from the car. Alright, well, I'll go on. So we'll go in the baggage cart here. We'll check out what's going on through here. There is something back here. There's the ragged diary. <coughs> Alright, nothing else in this room to see. Diary, wonderful new wood. I cannot leave my post. Please return the diary. I stay here. So let's go give the ghost his diary back. <coughs> hey, buddy, found your diary. Very well, here's your blanket right here. Very wise not to read my diary. If you had read it, it might be a spirit like me. I can go peacefully from this world, thank you. You'll probably never meet me again fairly well. <coughs> and as he begins to ascend, <coughs> eh, he changes his mind. Well, actually, maybe not. I've been here so long, I've gotten kind of used to it. Lawpaper is so great, maybe I'll stay here just a little while longer. I can leave whenever so. There is all there is to it. Okay, so this guy's gonna stay, and we're gonna go give the blanket back. <coughs> Here's your blanket conductor, dude. Thank you so much, and I'll be comfortable tonight. Of course, our yummy and sticky mischief maker is still large. Before I forget, this is just a gesture of thanks. A mushroom, that's actually nice to have. Um, so we'll toss this bow block. Oh, come on. <laughs> Alright. The shop is closed. Doing prep me for tomorrow's work. Really? Okay, I lost these shellings my ex boyfriend gave me, and they're all like full of memories. I need them back. Please. Okay. So, because the shop is now closed, that's a sign that there's nothing more to do today. So, <clears throat> we'll head back to the room, and we'll call it a night. And that ends day one on the Excess Express. <coughs> day two. <coughs> Let's check in with the dining car, see what's going on. Oh, we got an email. RDM issue five. Mervilly was taken to the hospital. Where's bringing the power of the stake? Kilo Hall Galleria. <coughs> Cooking for rookies, intermediate level. Peachy tart. Take a peachy peach and add cake mix, stir, and bake. Alright. Let's go check in with. <coughs> Let's go check in with the business guy on the train here. Nah, uh, he's not here. Actually, we should check in with Pennington. <coughs> What's going on? New cases arisen. Here's the deal. I woke up this morning, my briefcase was gone. Contained all the contacts for our next deal and even our new product prototype. Don't recover it, I'll lose my job at the least. <coughs> Company's new project is Nitro Honey Syrup. Used properly, it's an amazing product, can even raise the dead. But if mixed with calcium from a seashell and a bit of gold, well, these results are explosive. 
There's nothing Goo Blast would immobilize everyone here in a sticky a yummy shellac. It's fallen into the wrong hands. Well, I could lose more than my job. <coughs> Someone has stolen your briefcase. Definitely had it yesterday. The train has not stopped at all, intervening the time. I have it rudimentary. The thief is still on the train. You've spoken to the waitress and the lady in cabin too. They have both lost something. And the lady Toodles lost the gold ring. <coughs> if the same person stole the nitro honey syrup, they could make this goo blast. Must find that thief. Must apprehend the suspect before plans in effect. Alright, we haven't talked to Toodles yet, so let's go talk to her. We'll tell her we'll find her, her gold ring. Somewhere on this train, could you perhaps haste? Could you please haste and search? <coughs> By chance, is Zip Toad in his room? There's a piece of paper in his room. Final paper. Looks like something important and complicated. Uh, let's head back to our room now. <coughs> Remember if I had to. Nope. Maybe I had to do that in Zip Toad's room. Couldn't remember. <coughs> Let's check into Zip Toad's room again. To get the paper to Pennington first, probably. one of the contracts for my upcoming business deal. Where did you find this important clue? Cabin 1. Come to think of it, I don't think I've seen him today. Then perhaps he's hiding somewhere on the train. Find Zip Toad. Now I believe we have to go back to Cabin 5, Mario's room. <coughs> paper. Another clue. Paper's just like the last one. Suspect must be in here somewhere. <coughs> there he is. Gotcha. Youch. This is our man all along, pretending to be Zip Toad, I see. All the while pilfering thing from others to aid your evil plan. You know how long you were fake, just call her Nostro Hair, tip me off. Not only that, you were the one who threatened Luigi. <coughs> I was almost getting, getting away with it by getting off of Riverside Station. Jig is up, fiend. At least we're told what you was stolen. <coughs> There's the briefcase, a gold ring. And shell earrings. Here's your briefcase. <coughs> Attention all passengers, this train will still make a brief schedule to stop at Riverside Station.
Think not, Slick. You think you can hold me? Probably will flip. Surprise! It's Dupless! <coughs> and the rest of you who see ya, suckers. Toodles are still in her room or not. She is. Here's your gold ring. <coughs> Got 30 coins. Yay. Do take care. Alright, let's get off the train. Drop it here, please. The potion of the canal hasn't been used since. Okay, so I'm talking to the wrong person here. What do we do? Someone's lifted the drawbridge. Train, train can't leave the station like this. Saw a suspicious looking shadowy person wearing a hat going to the station. Must have gone down to the bridge control. I'll switch the flip there. She's been using so long, I don't know where the control room is. Probably against protocol, but. Since you are famous for Mario, could you find that switch? Maybe sure. That'd be super. Here's the station with <coughs> you. Alright. Let's save. <coughs> and let's head inside the station. Alright, there is a badge there. We'll be able to get that afterward. We're going to get the super boots while we're in here. We don't have the elevator key yet, we gotta find that key. <coughs> I'm trying to remember, do these come off? That one does. They come off, I just don't remember if uh, they have anything interesting on them. I nope, guess not, I guess it's just for show. Let's go under here. Hit this switch. And let's go up these stairs. Alright, out this door. <coughs> I'm going to switch to Goombella, first turn Tattle. <laughs> Rough Puff, don't confuse the Dark Puffs. Seven, attacks four. Miss me. Yep, Goombella is now attacking on threes because we upgraded her. <coughs> Whoa. Gonna be more of this. I'm gonna be attacking a bunch of stuff that moves for a while because we need to we need to get a bunch more level ups. Oops. 
think I remember how this puzzle worked. I'll get it right. There we go. Alright, good enough. We're gonna curl under here. We're gonna jump on here and then hit and get on the uh, <coughs> over here. And then go over here. And we're gonna have Coops shell toss this key. Station key. Alright. We got another station key, so let's head out this room. switch to Miss Mouse because I think there's a few star pieces to find out here. <coughs> I wouldn't mind seeing her fight it like a little bit either. Actually, Bella. this. Poison Pokey. <coughs> Alright, I'm going to see if I can fight with Myth Mouse for a little bit. <coughs> Let's see if she can hit these guys with her with her love slap. Nope, that hurts her. Okay, good to know. him out for uh Bobbery, I guess. Right. Oh, jeez, that was lucky. Get something by blowing these posters down. <coughs> uh, nope, those are on good. Okay. What do you say, Miss Mouse? What's what's around here? Q. 
he says there's stuff nearby, I just, uh... Gotta love Danger Mario, man. <laughs> Alright, good amount of points from that battle. Close to another level up. Lots of coins. This mouse seems to think there's something nearby, so I'm just kind of ground pounding every so often. Oh. All right, so there's a door behind these papers. We're just gonna get rid of these. <laughs> Looks like this might come off, though. Let's see if there's something behind here. No? Doesn't come off? Okay, then. Deeper inside the station we go. <coughs> Spiny beetles. Oh, I actually heard. That's surprising. Um, let's see. I got a spike shield on so I can do this. Alright, we need to swap out Flurry for somebody else. That might not do any damage unless he's flipped over. Yep, nothing. <coughs> okay, I'm gonna knock this other one over too. Oh, what am I doing? Duh. <coughs> Missed. Getting there, eight more points needed. There's another buzzy beetle. Yikes.
figures. Really? How does that miss? I don't particularly care to hold it that time. <laughs> Alright, that's enough for a level up. Absolutely time for some more badge points. Alright, what can we turn on? Anything that we need right now? We got three... There's a tornado jump. I don't really feel like doing that. Um, Alright. Nothing we really need to turn on right now. I'm gonna save those because we're gonna we're gonna get to a point where we're just gonna need much more badge points. Oh, I think I missed it. Let's see. What is that down there? <coughs> it appears to be a badge. Come on. Fog really necessary. bonuses all of a sudden. I don't even need them. I didn't hit that bonus. So we don't want to go there yet. Um, at least I don't think. Oh, you know what? There. Are, now I remember the thing about this. There are two. Uh, there are two paths to take, and we got to make sure we go down the right one. <coughs> if we go down this way, jump through here, and then whoops! No, nope, no. Nope. Go down this hole. Then down here, and then go left. There we go. <coughs> All right, we're 
making progress. We're gonna go through here. Play with this Goomba that's just here for no reason. I don't know why these Goombas are in here. <coughs> I'm gonna turn the first attack badge on just because these Goombas are in here. simple, hit this once, hit this three times, and hit this ten times. <coughs> Alright, up these stairs. Shine Sprite. That yeah, might be a little tricky to get. Yeah, all right. I'll come back when I have. Uh, I'll just yeah. I'll just grab these first. <laughs> we have the ultra boots. <coughs> the final boot upgrade. You can use a new jump prac a new jump technique too. <coughs> we can now do a spin jump and a spring jump. There we go. There's our spring jump. I've got it. <coughs> All right, let's get out of here. Can I get over there? Nope, nothing to see there. Uh, hang on. Oh, right. I do have to go that way. We'll go down here. I'm gonna grab that shine sprite before I forget. <coughs> All right, there we go. All right, now let's get this key over here. I have to go in this box. I have to hover over to this side. Then we can spring jump. And then we actually have to bump our head on this wall here. And that makes it fall. And now we got the key. Alright, and now it's time to exit. We've got the elevator key. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Now, because we have the Ultra Boots, we are attacking jumps on fours, so it's pretty great. <coughs> All right, we've cleaned up here. Time to head. Uh, time to head back upstairs and get to the elevator. Woo! 
Seems to be a divot in the stair here. Let's go check what's in here. Hey, look at that. Another HP plus badge. Normally that'd be helpful, but it's not that helpful in the uh, in pursuing danger Mario, so we're not gonna be turning that on. <coughs> Alright, to the elevator. Insert the key. There's a bunch of smorg here. These weirdos took the switch. So let's see if we can get these guys to go away. Ship will hit the switch. And there's the bridge switch. Yoink. <coughs> oh, pardon me, man. Congestion sucks. Alright, the bridge is going back down. Alright, now we're going to take the elevator back up. <coughs> we're going to exit the station. Actually, we're going to grab this first. Close call P, awesome. <coughs> Alright, we're gonna save so we don't have to go through any of that again. And we're gonna get ourselves on the train. Another email. King K. No, you remember me, how you doing? What you go off Kano and Fools? I'm still living in the minor league, we keep them busy. You know what that is. We ever gonna chill again or what? Just gonna be careful the next time. I'm gonna be way, 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 way better keeping it real. <coughs> All aboard! I love how the, uh, the toads just kinda let the train leave without him. <laughs> our last, next stop is our last Poshley Heights. Eventful day two. Time to call it a night. Oh, you know what? I also forgot to... It's day three. I forgot to give that chick back her earrings. Do I still have them? I do. Let's hope I can give those back later. I give them back now, but nobody's on the train. That's particularly weird. The only person on the train right now seems to be this toad that's running the shop, and he's knocked out. What's going on, buddy? You won't talk to me. He's... So, I can't buy anything in the shop. This little toad guy is knocked out. He won't wake up. That's particularly weird. <coughs> is anybody in their rooms? Another email? A patch. How's life going? So there's a time for every now and then a certain Flavia spits out some bit of dribble. 
Give the elegance what for. Save your princess. Hmm, Chubby Toad's not in his room. People seem to be missing from the rooms. The chef and the conductor. Wonder where everybody is. Let's go see if the engineer's in the is still in the very least running the train. <coughs> ah, at least he's here. What's going on, man? Quite a quiet morning this one. Quiet morning, wouldn't you say? Huh? What's that on the windshield? Whoa, there's a lot of them on the windshield now. <coughs> they are from the things in the station they must have stowed away. Had to ensure the passenger's safety, but I have to keep driving the train. Check on the passengers. Alright. couple of save blocks on this train. They're kind of ambiguous. There's one in the engineer's room. And then there's one in the red cart. I don't really know why they need those save blocks there. <coughs> they seem to be covering the whole train. Try and get just get these smart and get the heck out of here. There's a conductor. <coughs> Detective Mario saved us. Hey, I must have been taken by those black ones while I was sleeping. Seem to come through the baggage car with an open window, and they have many of pas paying passengers of the poor souls. <coughs> Can't give her back her earrings, that's alright. Okay, we're gonna jump on this pipe up here. I missed it. Well, I'm gonna try it again. Missed. Alright, I'm gonna go back through here and see if I can get on the pipe. Missed. Let's go all the way back to the wall. There we go. <coughs> Out the door. Alright, let's get on top of the train. Just get these smorg out of our way. Hitting our way, just keep trying to plow our way forward. These smorg are relentless. They really don't let me go on that much far forward. Nope, they're trying to keep me from going forward, so... There we go. Alright, we got far enough, now they're all collecting. Smorg monster, which we are about to fight. They have the rest of the passengers. <laughs> All right, let's have ourselves a fight. <laughs> All right. 
first. We're gonna get a first turn tattle. Smorg, 50, 50 HP. So we gotta... First thing I think we're gonna do is we're gonna art attack so we can get, um... We can get, uh, all these tentacles and do some damage at the same time. Again, we're gonna have Mario charge. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Kinda hard to super guard. Miss me? <laughs> Someone's got something. It was a hammer. Get out of here. <laughs> Alright, Kumbella's gonna multi bonk again. Oh, okay, that was weird. I'm gonna have Mario charge again. Hitting Gubella on fours, which really stinks. There we go. There was a super guard. Can Gubella not? Nope, won't do any damage, I guess, unless those tentacles are out there. Um, stop throwing rocks. I'm gonna have Mario charge again, and we're just gonna have to have Gumbella try and knock out these arms. <coughs> Ugh. It's hitting where it hurts, though. That's very unfortunate. Um. Let's see if we can Earth Tremor some of these arms. <coughs> I don't know if I've ever used this on this boss, but it, it kind of just makes me wonder. Hey, okay, that worked. Okay. Oh, Mario, I think Mario lost his charge, so we're just gonna have to... We're just gonna have to kind of do what we can here as far as power bouncing goes. Oh, no, he kept his charge. Oh, but, like, I kind of whiffed it because I was so surprised. That's really... That's really unfortunate. Um... That's all right. We've almost got it where we want it. That that goes for that took down Goombella. Um, all right, we're gonna we're already attacking on three, so I can get a normal jump on this arm here, <laughs> and the next hit will decide the fight. I'm upset about that. If I didn't whiff that jump, I would have had this thing dead already. That's all right though, and that's game. Not a great fight, but not terrible either. We did it. <coughs> we saved the passengers. Everyone's safe, it's all thanks to you. 
Thank you, shame my life, no stupid tongue, you saved my life. <coughs> Prepare to disembark. <coughs> and the train rolls into Postley Heights. <coughs> now arriving, please watch your step. Thank you for choosing Cestus for us. All right, we're gonna take a nap. <laughs> <coughs> All right. Let's uh, before we depart the train. Let's give um, let's give the waitress her earrings back. I think she's still on here. Yes, she is. Here you go. <coughs> And she gave us a nice start piece. All right. Now to exit the train. Here at the beautiful Poshley Heights, and we're gonna save so we don't have to go through any of that again. <coughs> this is a great place to walk and take a look around, but for right now, and there's a beautiful hotel there. We're gonna check this note here. Gone traveling, sank the manager. <coughs> what now? What are you doing on my doorstep, Luigi? <coughs> you live here, so you're the Sanctum Manager? I thought you were a detective. This is more like a hobby of mine, if truth must be told. Enough chatter, shall we go inside? Let's enter the Sanctum. And, oh no, the Shadow Sirens are already here. They're one step too late, we have the Crystal Star, and they're off. <coughs> Crowd, we're too late, we gotta go after them. Just a second, exactly what's going on here? Quite rudimentary, so you're looking for the Crystal Star in the Sanctum? Very interesting. No cause for worry. The crystal started and safe. Quite safe. The stone that our rude friends was stole was unfortunately a red herring. Real one is hidden somewhere in the sanctum to prevent such a theft. As the location of the real crystal star, as sanctum manager, I of course prohibited from telling anyone. Do you know where it is? That you can be certain. Besides, I'm a junior detect. I sure a junior detective like yourself can find it on your own. But all those razor sharp swooping skills taught you make me proud. All right, <coughs> let's go find that crystal star. Puzzle's really quite easy, actually. Stay in here. <coughs> Can't go over that way, so we'll go over this way. <coughs> Let's just check if there's anything over this way. Doesn't appear to be. Up here, drop. Anything over here? Nope. <coughs> and then go up here. And drop. Come over this way. <coughs> and we'll paper airplane to the other side. we hit that switch let me just make sure there's nothing over this way there is not <coughs> let's hit that switch <coughs> that reveals this little pipe here and we're inside this painting We're inside this, and uh, I'm gonna get Kumbella out here and see uh, 
what some of these ghosts are like. Could use a few points. <coughs> That's a dark bow. Attack the uh, HP Z attack is five. <coughs> We are attacking on fours. Uh, Goombella's attacking on threes. <coughs> they're dropping six. They're dropping three per kill, so I might stay here and grind on these boos for a little bit. Some great experience to grab. I know everybody watching is probably dying for me to get the Crystal Star right now, but um, need, need, need to keep leveling up some. <coughs> I will definitely, by taking out all these boos in the room, I will definitely be uh, getting an upgrade for a level up. I'm trying to jump more than I'm hitting the hammer because I'm attacking on fours on the jump. Which basically means I can do eight hit points of damage. <coughs> Alright, one more battle and I'll get a level up. And then I can finish up the rest of these dark boos and be closer to another one. Can't attack them, so we'll just defend.
Alright, one more boo left. He's trying to get out the window. that crystal star. I know there's a badge in here. I'm gonna just check out up here <coughs> for some stuff. Actually, I can't tell if she smells the crystal star or not. Anything back here to the wall? Anything at all? Nay, okay. <coughs> Alright, let's fly over this way. There's a shine sprite over here, definitely worth grabbing that. <coughs> and we're gonna grab this L emblem badge up here. Kind of fun if you have the L emblem and the uh, the W emblem it makes you have the Waluigi's clothes. Okay, just out of curiosity. Yep. <laughs> Crystal Star. Star power is now seven. We can finally use Showstopper. End of chapter! We found the sixth crystal star <coughs> in Craftily and Potchley Heights. Only one crystal star remains. Our hero still does not know where Princess Peach is being held. Where could the last star be and where's Peach? Hoping the star might yield answers, we return to Pennington. Let's save. Whoops. Okay. Now let's leave the sanctum. <coughs> so, <laughs> so that's where it was. Nothing, just talking. All Genius is doing. Congratulations, we found the real crystal star. Feel free to take it. I'll just put another fake one over there. Traveling me has been hectic, but I admit it's rather fun. Sure, I have a long road ahead. Do not give up. <coughs> Thanks, Pankton. You too. Alright, that about does it. Let's uh, check in quickly with Princess Peach. I know it's been a long episode, but let's uh, tie up loose ends with Peach, and then we'll call this a show. What's the matter with you idiots falling for a fake star that's asinine? Sorry dude, I mean sir. This means Mario managed to get the real star. I'm gonna say maybe. <coughs> Brr. Mustache Madison nearly has ever crystal star, they were mine. I think I'd better alter my plan a bit. <coughs> Before you do, Sir Gross, I think I'd better tell you something. Mumble mumble. What? Are you sure? No joke, I've seen it. Affirmative, sir, that is positive. Treason. <coughs> Strange isn't about time to attack the call me in. Maybe he's busy. Oh, here we 
here we go. <coughs> All right, let's go see what Tech's up to. <coughs> Hello, Tech, what do you want to do today? I have reached a conclusion. <coughs> Struggled letter to obey orders and speak to you, and I cannot confirm what I should believe. <coughs> you know, sound right, what's going on? Please escape from this place as quickly as possible. What do you mean by that? Why, all of a sudden, the data you procured has been analyzed, and something terrible is. I will not say, but I found everything about Sir Gross's plans. <coughs> Among those plans was the reason why he held you being here, according to the data. No way, it's, I don't believe it's impossible. Everything is true, that's why you must escape from here as fast as possible. I mean, I don't even have the slightest idea where I am. I'm not hiding anything, no, not for me, I'll tell you everything. The place where you are currently imprisoned, this is the moon. The moon in the sky, the moon? That is correct. <coughs> How am I supposed to escape? There is a way. You can escape, but you must follow my instructions exactly. If they know you help me, won't you get in trouble? As inconsequential, I'd like you to be safe, that's all that matters. I am the basis computer, no one will know of your escape if I keep silent. Please do not worry about me, escape as quickly as possible. Okay, I must inform Mario before I go, this is no longer just my problem. Understood? <coughs> right there, Peach. You. Miserable machine, we all know what you're up to, traitor. Sir Grotus, I... In my most paranoid moments, I never thought my own computer would betray me. Doesn't really matter in the end, I suppose, everybody, especially since I here, what are you planning to do? Only one thing to do with a malfunctioning computer, cut the circuit and delete all programs. All data relating to Peach must go as well. I must absolutely be sure nothing like this happens again. I'm normal, there is no malfunction. X nuts, at the same time, press the red buttons on tech sides. <coughs> Nail sense, Princess Peach, I love you. Deletion complete. Too bad, Princess Peach Tech is no longer with us. How could you? Just stop, there's no time to be worrying about a computer. It's very important things for you to do now. Well, that was a thing. All right, that is a good place to stop. Thank you for joining me with this long episode. Uh, wanted to get that chapter done. It's a great chapter, my favorite chapter. Uh, so we'll save, and in the meantime, until next episode, check out all the rest of the videos on the Grand Star Legion YouTube channel. Check out the official YTR forums, and check me out on YouTube at TechnoGeek, and find me at twitch.tv slash chaos control channel. Until then, I've been CDRM 1019, and we'll see you next video. Bye!